Can you believe that 2020 is right around the corner? If you're like us, then you're probably already planning or maybe have booked some cruises for the upcoming year. 2020 looks to be one of the most exciting years for cruising with some brand new innovative ships launching as well as ships coming out right now that you might want to sail on in the new year. I'm DB from EatSleepCruise.com and to help you narrow down your selections, We've put together this list of our top cruise ships to sail on in 2020. Norwegian Encore debuts this month, and we will be among the first passengers on board this final ship in the Breakaway Plus class. With some of the most innovative attractions on any cruise ship, including the longest racetrack at sea, a virtually enhanced laser tag course, and immersive virtual reality rides in the Galaxy Pavilion, Norwegian Encore will be a great ship option for the whole family. The ship will also feature the line's signature freestyle dining, as well as several specialty dining restaurants, including Cagney Steakhouse and a brand new Italian restaurant by Scarpetta. Norwegian Encore will also feature some brand new entertainment, including the Tony award-winning musical Kinky Boots, in addition to the wildly popular Choir of Man and Happy Hour Prohibition, the musical. When she debuts, Norwegian Encore will offer seven-day cruises to the Eastern Caribbean, visiting ports such as San Juan, Puerto Rico, the British Virgin Islands, and St. Thomas. When Oasis of the Seas debuted in 2009, the ship revolutionized cruising. As the largest cruise ship in the world, Oasis of the Seas ushered in a variety of new attractions and firsts at sea. Now, Royal Caribbean is looking to reimagine this namesake vessel to make it unlike any ship in the fleet once again. Perhaps some of the biggest changes coming to Oasis of the Seas will be the outdoor areas. The ship will be receiving the 10-story Ultimate Abyss, and will be also getting a trio of water slides known as the Perfect Storm. The ship will feature a brand new Caribbean-inspired pool deck, including comfy casitas, daybeds, hammocks, and swing seats. The dining on Oasis of Seas will also be upgraded to include the complimentary El Loco Fresh Mexican restaurant, a Playmaker sports bar and arcade, and the brand new restaurant, the Portside Barbecue. This upcharge restaurant will feature authentic barbecue favorites. The ship will also receive popular venues from other ships like the Bionic Bar and the Music Hall, as well as a spruced up karaoke bar and a brand new laser tag game and a newly themed puzzle break escape room. Debuting in November of 2020, Royal Caribbean's second Quantum Ultra class ship, Odyssey of the Seas, will begin sailing from Fort Lauderdale, Florida. Now, Royal Caribbean hasn't released that many details yet of this brand new ship, but we anticipate that the ship will have many of the features and components of its sister vessels. Among them would be the Nostar, the aerial gondola that rises over 300 feet above the ship, as well as the ripcord by iFly skydiving simulator. Most likely, the ship will also feature the Seaplex, one of the largest indoor sports areas at sea, along with entertainment in the main theater, Odyssey of the Seas will most likely have a 270, an entertainment venue that uses digital technology to enhance the storytelling. You can expect to find other favorites such as the Bionic Bar, in restaurants such as Chop's Grill, and the Whimsical Wonderland. The Princess and I are already booked for the four-day inaugural cruise in November of 2020, and we'll make sure to keep you updated on all of the announcements about dining, entertainment, and venues that's sure to come over the next 12 months. Also debuting at the end of 2019, Carnival Cruise Lines will launch Carnival Panorama. This third vessel in the Vista class of ships will be the largest ship to home port in Long Beach, California when she debuts. The ship will offer seven-day itineraries, visiting stops such as Cabo San Lucas and Puerto Vallarta. This innovative vessel will offer plenty for families and couples to enjoy. The outdoor decks will include a ropes course, the Waterworks Park with water slides and an expanded splash zone, and the one-of-a-kind sky ride, where you can challenge your friends to a suspended bike ride high above the Pacific Ocean. Carnival Panorama is also home to an IMAX theater showing first-run movies, as well as the Sky Zone, which will be a four-fee activity open to adventure seekers of all ages. Carnival Panorama will include a wide selection of culinary options as well, including the popular Guy's Pig and Anchor Barbecue Smokehouse and Brew House, as well as the Lion Signature Steakhouse, Teppanyaki Restaurant, and the Seafood Shack. While the ship is designed for families, those seeking an escape from the little ones can head to the Serenity Adults Only area, or you can consider booking a Havana stateroom 
to have access to your own exclusive pool area and amenities. Two Carnival Cruise Line trips in one year is a record for us. In August of 2020, Carnival Mardi Gras is set to debut as the largest ship in the Carnival fleet. While paying homage to the original TSS Mardi Gras, this new version will feature many firsts for the cruise line. With the new Zones concept, cruisers can enjoy a variety of themed dining and entertainment in these six unique areas. The French Quarter will be lined with bars and restaurants, including the Emeralds Bistro, a brand new partnership with celebrity chef Emeril Lagasse. The other zones include the Grand Central, as well as a summer landing featuring Guy's Pig and Anchor Smokehouse and Brewhouse. There's also the La Piazza, debuting a new Mediterranean spot specializing in seafood. Carnival Mardi Gras will debut the first ever roller coaster at sea. Yup, you heard me right. The Bowl is an all-electric thrill ride. Carnival Mardi Gras also plans to take its restaurants, bars, entertainment, and staterooms to the next level. And we can't wait to sail on this ship next year, doing a New England Canada cruise. Celebrity Apex, the sister ship to Celebrity Edge, will debut in spring of 2020, sailing its inaugural season in the Mediterranean from Southampton. Like her older sister, Celebrity Apex will be home to many of the same dining, entertainment, and onboard experiences. Some of the boldest features will be the magic carpet. This cantilevered floating platform serves multiple purposes, including as an alfresco dining experience, as well as a state-of-the-art tender station. Eden is a transformative venue, featuring relaxation with floor-to-ceiling views by day and unique, engaging entertainment at night. Eden is also home to some of the most experiential dining at sea. Celebrity Apex will also feature four different main dining rooms, each with its own theme, decor, and specialty menu items. The popular specialty restaurants found on Celebrity Edge will also be found on Apex. Cruisers on Celebrity Apex will also love the outdoor tranquil vibes of the rooftop garden, as well as the glamorous resort feel of the pool deck. The ship's unique theater design will most likely be home to unique signature productions that you can only find on the ship. Virgin Voyages is set to debut its first ship, Scarlet Lady, in April 2020. Of course, we're booked on the inaugural cruise. Scarlet Lady is breaking the cruise mold and restricting the age of its sailors to 18 plus. They're especially looking to appeal to those who might not ordinarily consider a cruise for their vacation. Scarlet Lady is also set to revolutionize the whole dining experience on a cruise ship. From casual options to upscale dining experiences, there'll be no upcharges to dine at any of the restaurants. All cruise fares will include basic beverages like soda, bottled water, coffee, and tea. Virgin Voyages will also not charge additional fees for other cruise add-ons like fitness classes or Wi-Fi. Entertainment on Virgin Voyages will be unlike anything else at sea, with a dynamic entertainment space that can transform from day to day, offering interactive and engaging entertainment. Currently, Scarlet Lady offers four, five, and seven night itineraries, but the ship's most anticipated destination is the cruise line's private beach club in the Bahamas and offer an expansive lagoon-style pool. The club's vibe will transform throughout the day with yoga and meditation spots in the morning to a high-energy DJ-led pool party during the afternoon and a beach bonfire to end the evening. Enchanted Princess will be the fifth royal-class ship in the Princess Cruise fleet when she debuts in 2020. She will set sail for a season in the Mediterranean, followed by Caribbean itineraries beginning in November. The ship will share all the spectacular style and luxury of its predecessors, while also introducing some new attractions of her own. Boasting the most pools and whirlpools ever, Enchanted Princess will feature two pools with sunken communal seating. In addition, the ship will also feature the Wakeview Infinity Pool and Bar, where you can score some amazing aft views. Like Sky Princess, cruisers can enjoy comedy and other live performances in Princess Live. They can relive the jazz era in the only jazz theater at sea and enjoy original nighttime productions exclusive to the ship. The Lion's signature movie Under the Stars and the Piazza with street performers will also be featured on Enchanted Princess. You will also never go hungry as all of your familiar favorites will also be included on the ship. Among the fan favorites are the crafted dishes by Curtis Stone found on select evenings in the main dining room. Enchanted Princess will also be added to the line of medallion class ships. With your ocean medallion, 
you can enjoy a more customized cruise experience. This starts with the embarkation process to automatically opening your stateroom doors as you approach and even more digital experiences. If you can't wait till 2020, Princess Cruises recently launched Sky Princess, which offers many of the same amenities and features as the Enchanted Princess. MSC Cruises' newest ship launches in fall of 2020. MSC Virtuoso will set sail and carry more than 6,000 passengers. Debuting less than a year behind its sister ship, Grandioso, the ship will feature several dining options, including a French bistro, a tapas bar, a tapiaki and sushi restaurant, as well as the signature steakhouse Butcher's Cut. MSC Virtuoso will feature two brand new Cirque du Soleil shows. For a little daytime fun, cruisers of all ages can enjoy the Polar Aqua Park, one of the largest water parks at sea. There's also the Sports Complex, an F1 racing simulator, as well as relaxation on one of the most spacious pool decks at sea. When the sun goes down, cruisers can enjoy game shows, comedy shows, karaoke, and live music at the TV studio and bar. Or perhaps you would prefer to dance the night away in the attic, the ship's nightclub. With the MSC for Me app and the virtual assistant Zoe, your cruise vacation will be seamless and effortless. American Queen Steamboat Company will debut the American Countess, the fourth cruise ship in the fleet in 2020. This new authentic paddle wheeler will launch on the Mississippi River. It will accommodate 245 passengers with well-appointed staterooms and onboard theater it's easy to traverse the U.S. rivers in style and old-time charm. American Queen Steamboat Company features guest historians, nightly entertainment, and fine dining that showcases culinary influences of America's heartland. American Countess also features complimentary room service, a fitness center, and a sun deck to satisfy all your needs 24-7. If you want to discover America from a whole new perspective, 2020 should be the year that you step on board a classic paddle wheeler. American Countess offers a variety of sailings from 6 to 15 days with various themes like the Antebellum South or Mark Twain's Mississippi. And there you have it. Those are our top 10 cruise ships you should be sailing on in 2020. But of course, we'd love to hear from you. Let us know in the comment section below what cruise ship you're most excited to sail on in the new year. I'm DB from EatSleepCruise.com, and if you enjoyed this video, we'd really appreciate it if you gave it a big thumbs up. If you haven't already done so, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to our channel and hit that notification icon. That way you're updated every week when we put out a brand new video. You can also find us all over social media at EatSleepCruise, and thanks again for watching.